Okay, I've had the GTX 295 uh, for about 24 hours. Um, been playing lots of games. So far, no micro store to report from the single card. Obviously, I, I can't try um, Quad SLI, so I can't really say whether that will or not. But it's um, good news really with the single card because the GX2 even single card configuration it wasn't too great. Um, I mean, I I've got a lot of games. Probably lots and lots and lots of games and basically in like about 99% of the games that I owned it was bad um, it wasn't just um, <coughs> crisis as some people have said I found it on Counter-Strike Source um, Half-Life Team Fortress 2 um, Company Heroes, literally the, the list just goes on and on and on that there was issues with. Um, the only game that I found it didn't stutter with was Call of Duty 4. Um, so that's probably easier to say that way, that's the only game. Every other game there was problems. Um, I'm going to do a few benchmarks. Um, I'm going to do the Far Cry 2 benchmark, um, Crisis Warhead benchmark, um, Stalker Clear Sky, and uh, 3D Mark Vantage Run. Obviously, I'm probably not going to be able to fit it all in on this video, um, so I might edit it down or add a second video. Um, settings 1920 by 1080, 8 times AA, DirectX 10, ultra high settings. Uh, I'm just going to do two loops to keep the video time down. And let's start the benchmark. I have to excuse the camera shake got no stand and that can be annoying I'm sure if um, someone will get a video up in the next few days hopefully I will if not I'm sure someone else will Okay, let's check the results. Okay, average results. Average frame rate, eighty point two one. Um, maximum frame rate, one hundred thirteen point ninety seven. Minimum frame rate, sixty three point one three. Now, as I've, um, I think on my last video, I can't quite remember what two GTS two eighties did. But it was either 80 or it was 82, so that's how close this one single card to come into two-way SLI, two 80s. That's really impressive. Okay, now I'm going to do a Crisis Warhead benchmark. Um, settings 1920 by 1080 again, no AA, two loops just for time. And um, Avalanche, DirectX 10 Enthusiast, so you can check that, 1920 1080, AA 0, two times loops. Avalanche, Dark Test 10, E for Enthusiast.
There you go, you can see minimum 39, maximum 72, average 52.83. Okay, now I'm going to do the 3D Mark Vantage um, performance preset. Um, physics off. Now I will be editing parts of this video out. No one wants to sit through a full Vantage run. There we go, 22,572 and I did the same test with two GTX 280s and my graphics score on the GTX 280s, two of them, was 21,995 CPU score was 24,434 so this time it's just nudged it and the overall score for the two GTX 280s was 22,558. So here you see it. One GTX 295 has just beat the two-way SLI GTX 280. Now that is fucking crazy.